Shit. Hello! So, today I'm presenting you um, something, a gift idea I have been doing for several years, meanwhile. So, these bad boys you're seeing in the background, I put first, so in the intro, is what we call eier liqueur. So, egg liqueur would be the one on one thing, but I think like eggnog, it's cold eggnog, would be probably more to this. So, yeah, I still haven't cleaned up. So, also this part and this part not. So, to have this a huge amount of counter space is very rare. So, yeah. And what you see is that I actually made much much more so this video has been in the making for five months so in here also wait wrong also in these and in voila, these so it's actually the same base so i put them in there so whenever someone is coming over, they're not seeing them all. And just those without a label are 
good to stay outside because nobody can knows what's coming going on. And if this is a walk through to well, they're the outdoor. So of course and his mom is on also or and his parents are going here quite frequently when they are over. The mom for smoking <laughs> and Andy's dad for helping outside. Whatever may come. So, and yes, you are yelling as X time. And I try to let you in an X time. Now you can be quiet. <sighs> okay. She won't be. Um, so excuse the cat meowing, but whenever I try to let her in, she's just running away. Awesome thing. So actually, what I did is I took the blossoms of those elderberry um, things and um, I read the recipe and it said to take those blossoms, those flowers, and I think I had to pick up 25. I put on top just three liters of water, one kilogram of sugar, that was a huge amount, and just let sit overnight. And then put, and the next day, put three bottles of high, of good alcohol in there. And yes, that's it. And the smell of this just watery stuff was so awesome. And um, I actually took it just the way it is. So this is without alcohol. Um, and in the recipe, there were some that said, oh, it's better to just have it um, with vodka and said that I should use something else. Um, and I just thought, well, why not take both? So I divided those three liters into three parts. And um, yeah, one liter per with vodka, one liter with the uh, doppelkorn, um, which is also a very high percentage, but it's made of uh, of, of corn. A corn, yeah, yeah, out of wheat. I think it's probably good Weizen corn. Uh. Um, yeah, I guess it's wheat. <laughs> so. Yeah, what guys are made out of potatoes, this is out of wheat. Um, so, yeah, I took the different because vodka is supposed to have less additional taste. And I both tried them. And actually, the vodka thing is better. Is it just a shadow or do I have some... <sighs> okay. Back to this. Um, Andy's mom is not drinking any alcohol. So I just put it the way it is. And so it's just some kind of syrup. And I put it into some uh, water, so some mineral water, and it's really good. So I think about actually gifting those without any alcohol to the mom. And I think Andy's brother is, no, he's drinking wine. I think he should be good. Um, nevertheless, so I have different kinds of things. Um, the one I showed you, this is looking, which is looking so good. I made this in a big thing, in a big bowl. And let it, you have to let it sit for four to six weeks. And then you just can put it out. But... Um, it looked awesome, but the smell was crazy. So, not everybody's favorite, I think. But to have something like this just standing on a shelf, just look at this. I mean, this is amazing. The sugar would, will dissolve with time, so you have to just shake it from time to time. But it will dissolve and it looks, I, I really like just the look of it. Um, I have to buy a little bit more alcohol. I thought that 200 milliliters were a little bit more. So I guess I need some more to fill it up. 
but this looks awesome. And I just didn't do a full vanilla um, thingy because, yeah. They, first of all, they are expensive. Second, if you want to drink this, I think this would be very vanilla. And um, I just took a small anise thingy here because the taste of anise was crazy in the last batch I made. So yeah, and I think these bottles are still sitting around at all, with all the guy people I gave them to. So yeah, just don't overdo it. So I put, I tried to stick to the recipe I saw there for. And I should have put even more anise in these. So anise stars in those, in this bowl and it was like, no way. <laughs> I just, I think I just took eight of the supposed 20 and it was crazy. So yeah, it would have been more like the, um, what is the Greek, the Greek thing? Uh, Uzo. <laughs> so it would have been more like Uzo and uh, yeah, it's not everybody's darling. Sorry for this one. So. <laughs> Have in mind, most of those you need to prepare in advance. It needs to stay four to six weeks, as I mentioned before. Um, but then, they, then you are good. Well, you can make it like I did with this one. Then you can give it right, right away. And also these eggnog things you can make right away. So they just have to cool down and they are good. So, and uh, my... Oh, what I did is I created some <clears throat> labels with Canva. So this is all I did. Um, yeah, here I just put some labels where I wrote with my hand. So just handwriting like from with vodka and with the other thing. So just made this one. But as you can see, I have some of those sitting in my drawer. <laughs> waiting for Christmas to come. <laughs> so, I hope I could inspire you with this one and I hope I see you in the next one. Bye-bye.